What's up, my beautiful people? This is AV, and I'm back again with a new video. This time, a brand new page from my upcoming comic issue number seven, Nothing Good Ever Happens at 4 a.m. A horror comic based in Oakland, California. Uh, this page uh, is one that I was really excited to ink. Uh, where zombies are feasting and eating. It's a little funny or odd, but I really enjoy drawing zombies, eating flesh, or killing people in weird ways. But often, uh, I'm actually really, really um, excited to figure out new ways to kind of uh, tell the same story or draw the same type of thing. So, uh, whenever I can figure out a way to make something more bloody, more gory, or just or just find a unique way to freak people out. Especially since I feel like I am a comic newbie and I'm still learning um, the most efficient way um, to visually get across what I'm saying. So I don't like to repeat um, the same thing, even though it is a zombie or horror comic. Uh, maybe it's my dark sense of humor, but if I can make you laugh or uh, shock you or kill someone in a brand new way, I'd like to explore that in my latest issue. Um, um, even though it m might sound funny, I do like to make the drawings as beautiful as possible, even though it's a horrific uh, theme or really scary theme. I do like the artwork to be just visually stunning and impactful. I like a lot of high contrast and obviously I like a lot of line work. So this is, these are things that I'm exploring whenever I st start drawing a new comic book. Uh, just finding new, new, unique and new ways to um, draw the viewer in and make it um, exciting and make it um, just more pleasurable, if that makes sense, uh, for the reader to get uh, pulled into the story and so that I keep uh, the viewer, the audience, in attention to the artwork and not just the plot or the storyline, but actually what they're seeing on the page. And so those are some of the things I'm thinking about when I'm drawing a new comic book page is how can I not only freak people out or scare them or creep them out, but how can I keep the viewer engaged and wanting to turn the page and look at something new or maybe something they've never seen before. Um, these are the things I'm thinking about, especially when um, it is something so gruesome. Uh, you can't just rely on shock value. Uh, uh, you do want your art to be at the forefront, at least for, m for myself. Um, that's what my goal. Um, I really like sharing these ideas with you guys. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. And um, please like and share the video. Uh, it helps uh, YouTube push my videos to the front. Um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, like I said, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Hit the bell to be notified so you know when I'm dropping a new video. Uh, thank you to all the new followers on um, this platform, but also on uh, TikTok and Instagram. Make sure to let other folks know. I'd like to get to uh, a thousand followers. So let other folks know what I'm doing here and also on Patreon. And when you uh, go to the link in the description box, uh, you can check out my Patreon page. Uh, there's a lot of exclusive content there. Uh, like I said, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.